is in this video we are going to see insertion in a linked list uh, in the unordered list we will be inserting we will be getting the position and then we will decide whether we are going to insert it as a first node or last node or in the in between but here it is not like that since it is an ordered list while inserting itself the algorithm will find the correct position and it will insert so that is how we have written this algorithm so what happens is here we pass the value. Suppose I am going to insert the value uh, 25. Imagine you are going to insert a value 25. So here we pass the value 25 and then um, three pointers, three temporary pointers we use. They are called previous, current and temp. Then we use a local variable called integer variable called found where we will keep one or zero based on the search. If the search uh, algorithm find the data in the linked list then it returns one else it returns zero and it will return the previous and current pointer if it is found then uh, what is the day uh, that, that that particular current will have the node which is already present there or else it will be in between so if it is found that means say for example 25 i'm passing 25 and that node is already present no need for me to insert it again so in which case the phone will be one and you can write data already exists and quit or else you are going to insert that node so while insertion you have to check whether that will be the first node so first you are creating that node by using the new node new the new operator and then you create a node type where data and it has the next field and then in the data field you write the data that is 25 let us imagine now we are passing 25 since in this uh, it searches the search will search and it will return a zero because 25 is not present so what happens uh, here let us uh, imagine this is the now say uh, this is the starting uh, this is the head node um, okay now this is a head node and this is a previous node now uh, search will move and this is the current node now since it is not equal to 10 is lesser than 25 it moves the current to the next location and the previous is now pointing this now again 20 is lesser than 25 so again the current is current node is moved here and the previous node is moved here but now when it checks this data 25 is smaller than 40 so now what happens it comes out so uh, it returns but it returns a current pointer which is nothing but 115 and the previous which is nothing but 105 these two locations it will return to the called program so here what happens we get that value previous and current so now we check whether previous is equal to null in this case previous is not equal to null it is pointing to some memory location which means this is not a first node to be inserted so in that case what we have to do we have to manipulate the pointer which means here we have already this will be a null pointer previously when it is created it will be a uh, null pointer when a temporary node is created, it will be a null point. So here we write the data and then we in this we are going to manipulate. So how we will be doing uh, here in the temporary, uh, this has to be connected with this and uh, this has to be connected with this. So how it can be done in the temporary next, what we have to do is we are going to write the current, which is nothing but 115. So that can be done by this statement. We will see this later. But here since previous is not, is not equal to null, this part will be skipped and else part will be. So in temp next we write the current accordingly. So this current location is written here. So first always you have to do manipulation in the temporary node. Then what you have to do, you have to manipulate the previous node next to field. So in that what you have to do, you write that temporary pointer value which is nothing but now 120 so that is what in program we do in previous next you write the 
temp value. So that's what here in previous next we write the temporary pointer. Now if you see that after 10 it is 105 this memory location then after 20 after reading this this 120 which is nothing but this node then after this this node now it has been inserted so after this only this will be accessed and after this this will be accessed now the data has been the node has been inserted now imagine we have the value 5 this is the newly created temporary node now how i can do that let us have go back to the old old scenario so uh, just let me write an all pointer and here it has 115 okay and then, right now this is the uh, condition now what happened these are the previous no and this is the current no initially when the search algorithm starts what happens it checks now it checks for five if you see this algorithm it checks uh, let us imagine we have the value five that is what we are going to insert now what happened previously it will be null so this will be null and then current is pointing to the head pointer now well, current is not equal to null okay that condition is true current is not equal to null. but what happens to this condition data is not greater than 10 which means it is lesser so this while loop will not get executed now it comes to the if class so while current if current is not equal to null yes that is true but is it current data is equal to s data no that is also not this current data is 10 but our s data is 5 such data is 5 it is also not so what happens it comes to the else spot it returns a 0 but it will return both previous and current node current node is still pointing this and previous is pointing to the null so what happens this is the condition previous node is pointing to the null and current is still pointing to the, it is not moved so what happens uh, now we have to go to this the previous is if previous is equal to null means which means this is going to be the first node to be inserted so in that case what we are going to do how to manipulate the pointers now you remove this in this temporary node you have to write the head node now this will become the head node so what you have to do you have to make this head to point to this so how it can be done okay now it is made to point to this now head is pointing this and then this uh, here head is made temporary next will have the head value so and then head is pointing to the head is pointing to the temp that is what we have done so here it is 120 now this 100 head is nothing but have the value 100 so that is made uh, now what happens uh, and head is made to point to the next so here initially what we do is in temporary next we manipulate the value 100 that is what is head is pointing it is pointing to this memory location so that will be written first and then the head is made to point to the point uh, temp now what happens now head is pointing uh, first this and then it is pointing to the next answer now this has been inserted as a first node 